when the moon meets your eye like a spicy meatball that's called amore welcome ladies and gentlemen boys and girls man and machine everything in between to ratatouille the video game for the playstation 2 here on this lovely november day hopefully before thanksgiving you know foods in the air demo what the hell it was about to go into demo mode you saw that shit anyways while we all prepare to stuff our faces with turkeys and then fall asleep and then wake up and stuff our faces again and then regret our decisions the next day we're gonna sit down and play some ratatouille for the playstation 2 because the 360 and the psv uh ps3 versions suck ass for some reason they're way worse so funny thing about me in this game i actually i actually did grow up playing this game well i say grow up but oh wow i can only use three letters i didn't well then of course of course we got to go with the obvious one right rat that's what i am i'm a food rat so i tested it out just to see if the game worked earlier i played this game before this is a game i had on my own ps2 i still have the uh i still have i actually still have the physical copy of the game which is really entertaining to me anyways also this game has like uh two player mini games for some reason but if you guys never watched Ratatouille, I recommend that you get yourself familiarized. Because the movie itself is pretty goddamn good. It's a fun watch. It's good to watch during th Thanksgiving. And it puts you in the mood to get ready to cook your ass off, which I'm going to do today. Because I actually have quite a bit of cooking to do today myself. Even before Thanksgiving. Now yep, you're clean, pal. Move it along. Hey, little brother. Are you finished yet? Just about, Dad. Can't a rat work in peace around here? Yeah, hey, man. Can a Listen, rat just sniff, sniff some shit in peace, dog? Over. Get cracking and collect those apple cores before she wakes up. There's more stuff to be collected, boys, so get moving. And for crying out loud, Emil, stop eating all our supplies. Uh, what supplies? Remy, keep an eye on your brother. Make sure he leaves some for the rest of us. Why are you walking like that? Because I eat with these paws. Well, go ahead, but Dad won't like it. Last thing he wants is for you to act human. Yeah, I know. Remy, come on. Dad wants to get some apple cores. Maybe I'll even show you some sweet moves along the way. Look! Food! Follow me to pick them up. <coughs> I'm still having a... I'm still having a little bit of a cough, right? I'm still getting over a cold that I had. Sucks. <laughs> All right. So, right off the bat, you're just gonna notice this game has a lot of bloom effect, and I apologize for that. But that won't be, that won't be a, a constant thing throughout the game. Just for just for the early levels, you're gonna see a, you're gonna see Remy manifest his his stand. <laughs> but the later levels, it doesn't it doesn't uh it doesn't look as pronounced as it does right now. So. Ratatouille for PS2 is actually really fucking good. Surprisingly good. It's one of those... It's one of those games that, uh... One of those licensed games that just came out pretty well. And I liked it, and it's... It's just, you know, it's just a fun fucking time. It's not a hard game. Not everything gotta be challenging. You don't gotta play God of War on fucking the hardest difficulty known to mankind and fucking fight the Valkyries and shit. You just sit here and collect some goddamn apple cores and have a good time, you know? Hey, Remy! 
Watch me use my amazing muscles to get up on the flower pots. Oh yeah? Get up on those flower pots, dog. Be good. You know what? Okay, why don't you try it? That was pretty Whoa. good. But but how? I know. Pretty amazing, huh? Sometimes I'm not quite sure myself. But hey, just pick up the food and meet me over at the fishing net. I gotta say, I'm probably one of the few people that find rats adorable. I always find them adorable, hey, even okay. though they're little trash bastards. I like rats. Hey. I like, uh, you know, I like ferrets. Ferrets are cool. Ferrets are adorable. How do you not like ferrets? I used to own a sugar glider. I have fun having having that around. People still ask me, uh, people still ask me a lot about it. And I tell them the same goddamn thing all the time. They're like, how do you take care of one? I'm like, you gotta get one really young. If you get one, if you get an older one, it's gonna take a lot of getting used to. Oops! Master, huh? I can't be amazing all the time. I'll go around. Press X to jump, and then square to hang time, baby. You got this. Make sure you grab these apple cores. I got an idea. We can use those cans to get on the roof. They look like <coughs> Jesus. Wait a minute. Emil, I'm dying. I'm Help me. Usually the one with the great ideas. You mean all the great ideas that get me in trouble? Anyways, I'll, I'll wait for you near the window. Meal's pretty impressive for a big fat rat. It's very agile. Okay, Press square to hold okay. things, grab them, move them around. This will come in handy later. What was that about? Hello. <laughs> so this playthrough can either go one of two ways right now, okay? It can either... The game can either crash like a motherfucker because I'm currently rendering something in the background. Or it can be flawless. Your choice, game. Your choice. Mission complete. Here's your rewards. Points mean nothing to me. Let's move on. Hey Remy, check out my acrobatic skills. Emil, what are you doing? You're gonna hurt yourself. Don't worry. I'm an expert. Try that, little brother. I'll be waiting over on the chest. Hey, the fact that you can even do one is pretty impressive. Hang on some poles and start spinning. Okay, sometimes, sometimes the controls are a little bit non-responsive. But for the most part, they work. There you go. Look, some more apple cores. Use that super sniffer of yours to find them all. I'll meet you when you're done. Wait, why do I have to do all the... Work? Because then there wouldn't be a video game, huh, genius? Thanks for the tip. X the same thing when I play Grand Theft Auto, right? Why do I gotta do everything? Because then there wouldn't be a video game. All you gotta do is follow the damn train, CJ. <laughs> That's all I can think about right now. Oh my god, fucking speaking about that, Grand Theft Auto is getting a remaster trilogy, which is interesting, but it's also nice to see that CJ and gang still don't know how to take their fingers apart. You look at the trailers for that and I'm just staring at I'm just staring at fucking CJ's hands and I'm like still can't take those fingers apart man that's the one thing I want to see one of these days he'll be able to use all his fucking fingers come on let me get up there 
Gotta get those apple cores. I find it really weird that for some reason, uh, when they were making this game, they were like, hey man, what do we need for collectibles for rats? Well, obviously it gotta be apple cores. What do you mean we gotta have cheese? You know, gotta be cheese. What kind of rat you know going for cheese? Rats don't like cheese. Also, I gotta ask, why is it, why is it that, you know, we, when we think about rats, oh, yeah. we think about rats going to get the cheese. But cheese is a completely man-made thing. So what the fuck were rats eating before cheese? Maybe it was apple cores. Oh, oh God, oh, now I'm thinking about it, my fucking, this. oh no. My worldview has been distorted. <laughs> Nothing doesn't make sense anymore. work buddy for those who don't notice there's a little easter egg the ball is the one from Toy Story yay cause Pixar loves us oh, yeah. cheese you used to increase your health well not increase your health but restore your health there's also collectibles in the level I think but since this is an intro level, I don't think there's any collectibles. There might be. Huh. I wonder what this is over here for. Might be a collectible. Let's check. Let's check it out. Ow, I hit my little, my little rat hands. there be something over here. Eh, doesn't matter. Doesn't matter. We're not fucking sitting here 100% in this game. We're just having a good time. Getting ready to eat some food for the holiday. Get fucking fat. That's what I want to do. By the way, where's the last apple core? It's outside. Thank you. Okay. Now we're going to use this rope to get to the roof over there. What? Are you crazy? We're rats, not birds. Nah, never mind. Just watch how it's done. Okay, okay. You know, I find it... I'm, I'm pretty, uh, jealous. That, like, you know when you wake up in the morning? And you walk outside and you see the squirrels and they're like running up and down the fucking trees and shit. And you sit there and you just go, how come God has forsaken us and we can't do that? Why can't I have fucking scale walls and shit? Like a squirrel or a spider. Meet me down there on the wall and don't forget the apple cores. Mission complete. Do the tutorial. Don't you feel so knowledgeable now? Now we're gonna land on those sparkly posts. Watch this. You should be careful. You might break something. Can you please just watch? Then meet me over there by the pile of wood. So if you haven't gotten it by now, this game kind of controls. Instead of playing as a raccoon, you play as a rat. This game kind of controls a little bit like Sly Cooper, where, you know, you just press square to do most of the platforming. It's just a nice, chill-ass time. I'm just out here living my rat life. Grabbing some apple cores. Walking on my fucking... Walking on my back feet. Okay. You can use boxes like this to hide. Just, just pick it up and climb underneath. And you can move around unnoticed. Oh, 
So if I'm in the box, no one can see me? <coughs> exactly. No one can see you unless you move. So basically, you hop in here and you get a little meter, a little Metal Gear Solid meter. The more you move, the more they'll notice you. But you get some good, you know, you get some good leeway with it. There you go. Let me show you how to defend yourself. We'll use that as a weapon. Emil, you're really starting to freak me out. Where did you learn how Just to Just murdered a baby. This? Seriously, I really don't know. Who are you? <laughs> you think you know somebody. How'd you learn all this? Honestly, I don't know. Who, who are you? Okay, okay. Not gonna lie, that's kind of funny. So you grab weapons, and you beat the shit out of enemies with it. There's not a lot of combat in this game. It's mostly platforming. And a little bit of puzzle solving. Last thing, we're almost done here. This one is about rafting, and believe me, little brother, I'm <coughs> an expert in that. So just watch and learn, and don't forget to pick up the food. I know, you've told me that like a hundred times. Yeah, yeah, just follow me. <laughs> I love him just paddling away. Thank you. Alright. So pretty self-explanatory, you just hop in here and you just, you know, move around with the analog stick, nothing, nothing too difficult. This is why you play the fucking PlayStation 2 version. And I think I think maybe the Wii version might be the same. I think there's a Wii version of this game. If you ever get stuck inside the whirlpool, you just, you know, mash the square button, push yourself out of there. Nothing crazy. You can jump while you're doing this. Don't worry about don't worry about uh where your thing is cuz it's always going to be under you. Your little raft. And just like that, everything's coming up Millhouse. Our health goes up. And we're just having a good time. Why do you want to come up here again? Well, I need your help. With what? This. It's a cookbook by Auguste Gusteau, my favorite chef, with all sorts of mouth-watering delicacies. Wow. Wow, Remy. I didn't know you could read. Just come on. I'll, we'll get it now, and I'll tell you more later. Daddy? Damn, Granny. Just a couple of rats. Uh, it's my book. I need that. Oh, now the pages are going to get all wet. Books ruined. Okay, what's going on with the audio? That was terrible. Not gonna lie, that sounded really bad. Oh no, my rat colony. Don't leave without me, people. You guys are leaving me behind. I'm the only rat that can read. 
Now I'm, I'm the only one who can tell you guys what to eat and what not to eat because there's rat poison and everything. Don't leave me behind. Oh shit. Oh no, the whirlpool's got me. God, you're kind of an asshole because you keep striking these trees in front of me. I'm just trying to get together with my rat family. Uh oh. Come on. Whirlpool's got me. It's a lot of force to go against. Come on, come on, come on, Whirlpool. Jesus. <coughs> that book has to be ruined now. No, Remy, your family's the other way. What are you doing? Oh, poor little rat man. comes to us all, especially chefs. The critics have dropped my restaurant from five stars to four. I believe you, mon petit ami, can help me get that star back. Rebuild Gusteau's? I think I can handle that. Great, I'm a rat with fucking schizophrenia. I must have rabies. Guess I'll just leave this cookbook behind then. Hold L1 to use your rat vision. It tells you where to go when you're lost. Pick up stars to 100% levels, I guess. I don't know. I think you get a... I think you get something for it, like concept art or some shit. I'm not sure. A ratapult. I like the music that's playing. It gives me a good old, uh, gives me a nice, like, Cats Don't Dance vibe. Thank you. 
Uh oh. No, no, no. Ow. Damn it. Pick up cheese to get your health back. Especially when you fuck it up like I did. I thought I can jump while I'm on this. Oh. There we go. Uh oh. That's ice. Oh, come on. Use the radipole. Use it. Remy? I think I've got this height control, no problem. How did I end up in here? I don't know. I guess I just fell from the rooftop. Wait a minute. Somebody's fucking up the soup. Well, we can't let that stand. Nuh-uh. Not while I'm here. All right, let's see. Get some of those onions in there. A little bit of that cucumber. Some of that cauliflower. More of that cauliflower. A lot of cauliflower. Some more cucumbers. Or zucchini. I don't know what the fuck it is. More onions. Can't have enough. Really like onions. And a little bit of that carrot. There you go. Just a little bit. Give that texture. So what the fuck, did a rat just, rat just cook my soup? Ow. I tried to run for it. I can't, there's too many wires around me. All right, sliding out pipes as fast as you can and beware for traps. Hold R1 to speed up, X to jump. Sometimes speeding up is the bad thing to do. Because you go a little bit too fast and you can't control yourself. But it is fun to do. Right. Oh shit! I'm going so fucking fast! Fast as fuck! You didn't even know how fast I am! Ah! I'm really hungry now. <laughs> All that cooking's got me hungry. We thought we'd never see you again. This is great. You're back home. Whoa, wait till Dad finds out. Finds out what? Remy. Thank goodness you're alive. Dad, it's great to see you too. But what are you doing here? We're here because of your harebrained scheme back at the cottage. It's hard to move a village, you know. 
find that a new poison checker has been a complete disaster. I'm sorry, Dad, but I'm here now, and I want to help. All right, all right. Follow me, and we'll get to work. See what you got for me, Dad. Use a spoon to break the boxes and see what's inside of it. It's usually okay, stars. Okay. Ah, Remy. I've been waiting for you. I'm sorry, Dad. I got lost and ended up in Paris. Speaking of good food, they feed dogs a bucket of scraps in the courtyard every day. We need to get a hold of that bucket. Yeah, but how? Ah, don't worry about it. Just use that nose of yours to find the other rats in the courtyard. They know all the details. But remember, beware of the dogs. Dogs. Great. I'm a chef's chef too.